Hi, Room One Gang. This is Mrs. Laird. I never really thought I would have to be leading a lesson like this in my living room. Look, I have helpers. Say hi. Say hi. Mo pa. <laughs> anyway, we are home to stay safe because there is a bad virus going around called the coronavirus or COVID-19. And it's, these are scary times, they're strange times, um, but in a way they're also, there's some silver linings. We, the pace of life gets to slow down, we get to spend more time with our family, and um, there are definitely ways that we can stay safe. We just stay safe by basically staying, staying home. Um, you might, if you are, if you do go out and about, if you go out for walks or go out to play in your yard, you might see people starting to wear masks. I have one. Sometimes I wear it when I'm outside. Well, most of the time these days, if I go outside, I wear my mask. Um, the masks mostly are meant to to keep your germs to you so other people don't get your germs. I guess a little bit the masks help you from getting other people's germs, but mostly the masks help you to keep your germs to yourself. Um, just like we talked about before, before school stopped on March 13th, this is a great time to wash our hands a lot and we have to wash them really, really carefully. The fronts and the backs. We're gonna do a lesson on hand washing. Um, that's gonna be uploaded. I, I did send you guys a brain pop lesson on hand washing, but we're going to do a Mrs. Laird lesson. Um, so we need to stay in the house. We need to eat healthy food. We need to wash our hands a lot. We need to try to get exercise in a way that's safe. If we go out for walks with our masks on, oh, different color one, and we avoid crowds of people and outdoors and don't touch lots of things, sometimes that can be safe. Probably if you're going outside, you should have a grown-up with you or someone who knows what you're doing if you're going to leave your own yard. Um, so getting exercise, trying to get fresh air in a safe way, eating healthy food, getting good sleep, washing our hands a lot. These are the ways that we're, that we're going to all get through this pandemic and stay healthy. And um, if we hang in there pretty soon, we're going to be able to end up back at school and moving around and groups of people and hanging out with friends those times will come back um, we just need to be patient and take care of ourselves until then I uh, know that mrs. Jones and mrs. Shank and I think about you all the time every day we put a great deal of thought into how to try to get some lessons ready for you how to keep us connected how to keep us learning so you're not alone we're not seeing each other face to face but we're still together, we're still the Room One gang, and eventually we'll move past this. So continue to take care, listen to mom and dad, make good choices, and know that we're thinking about you.